your girl Gladys aka is that your hair and welcome back to my channel so today I have a brand new unit from Bobby Boss and this unit is called Yara Roots if you like wigs I'm sure you're familiar with the original Bobby Boss Yara it literally took YouTube by storm like everybody in their mama their grandmother their grandfather the name of this wig is Yara 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 and this is a Bobby Boss wig I know everyone goes crazy over the Yara blunt cut bob wig. Sold out. Like, I was amazed by this. I was like, I need that in my life. This blue, this is so bomb. It spoke to me. A lot of people have been reviewing this hair. Everybody and their mother was reviewing Yara. I think Bobby Boss is the first one to come out with this type of um, asymmetrical blunt cut style in synthetic wig world, at least. So, soon after Bobby Boss did it, everybody started following the suit, like all the wig companies. And it, it was a hit. After that, Yara came out with the whole family. And I'll enter the picture of what that looks like. So, Bobby Boss was like, you know what? It's time to make some more coins with this Yara thing. Let's see if we can push it a little bit further and come out with Yara Roots. I actually won this wig in a giveaway that Bobby Boss had on their IG page. Thank you, Bobby Boss, for sending this to me. So I have Bobby Boss Yara in this green, pink color. What's new about this Yara wig is that it has a beautiful array of colors that you can choose from all here, but also it has these illusion roots. They're not just dark rooted like, oh, number one here and then the rest of the color, no. It's like the roots are blended in with the actual color of the unit, which I do think is pretty cool. And I would love for other companies to kind of follow suit with that. Oh, look at you, Bobby Boss. You got a certificate of authenticity. Here's the thing. They're only coming out with 200 units of this. So they're trying to be a little exclusive. Bobby Boss done made 100K on Instagram and now they got certificates of authenticity. I see y'all, Bobby Boss. Another new thing about this Yara unit is that there's a hyper blend colors. You might notice it in this wig, but it's probably more noticeable in the other colors available where there is a fine blending in the colors. It's not always visible from the offset, but if you look closer to the wig, you'll see how blended the colors are, which is nice. And comes with a five inch deep lace part. So this wig comes with your standard cap construction. It has the two cones right here on the side, which is where I like them. Cone in the back and adjustable straps. Let's jump into the pros of Bobby Boss Yara Roots. First pro will definitely have to be the color selection. I love all of these colors that they're offering with this unit. But with this color, I honestly am not too sure. When I first saw it on, on Instagram, I, I was feeling it off the bat. But now that I have it, I'm like, uh, maybe I should have went with the mint green. I don't know. The blending of this is what attracted me initially, and it is nice. It's definitely unique. But I kind of wish it was just this color. Like, I kind of just want this green color. Also, I noticed on camera, it, the color, the true color is not picking up. It looks really blue to me. Does it look blue to y'all? It looks blue to me. In person, it looks more green. But yes, the color selection available for this unit is definitely a big pro. Another pro to this unit is this hyper blend of roots. I think that is so freaking cool. Like, look at how this is so nicely mixed in the 1B to this green color. You don't see that type of coloring on synthetic wig units. I'm sorry, you just don't. So I really appreciate Bobby Boss being innovative in that way and stepping their game up with the rooting. Another pro to this wig would be the style. I love bobs and I like that it's short and off the shoulders. When it comes to synthetic wigs, the more that the synthetic fibers rub against your skin, the more likely it will fray and thus it affects the longevity of the wig. So it's nice when you have something asymmetric because the back, you know, has less exposure to your skin and that ensures a longer lasting unit. 
Unfortunately for me, I'm not a big fan of asymmetrical units like this, hence why I did not purchase the original Bobbi Boss Yara. I just was not interested in the style whatsoever. I was more so interested in Bobbi Boss Xenon because it was shorter, still asymmetrical a little bit, but I, I just really like this type of length. When it comes to bobs, I like this. I'm not a big long bob person at all, but I was curious about some of the new improvements that Bobbi Boss made. So I wanted to try out this unit. The only con I would say to this unit, um, well, to me, it's not very big head friendly. I have a medium sized head and I don't have the strap suggested and it's fitting me just right. So I can imagine if you have a chrome dome, you know, you might have a little, little trouble with the YAR unit. I don't know. Let me know if you've had YAR before and if you have a bigger head, did you have trouble wearing it? To me, it feels like this might be a little snug but let me know what you think. Other than that, I think she's a cute unit, but honestly, I'm really tempted to cut her. Tempted to cut, tempted to cut. I just really, <laughs> I don't want it to be this length. Y'all gonna watch me cut her. <laughs> okay, let's go. Can't turn back now. cutting i'm not a professional when it comes to cutting i just like to do it and when it comes to straight units it has to be really like precise i can't really do that well with these scissors i would probably have to use my um uh razor and kind of get the ends to make it even but tell me what you think do you like her cut or do you prefer her longer let me know tell me the rest of your thoughts on this unit how do you feel about bobby boss and their improvements on yara how are you feeling about the hyper blended roots and color do you like this mix which color would you try let me know in the comments down below if you've tried yara would you get the yara roots and of course if you like this video make sure you like comment and please subscribe y'all help me so much when you subscribe to my channel and when you like and especially when you comment because engagement is so important also a few of you all have asked me about makeup tutorials i do not think i have any place telling people how to do their makeup i think i do my makeup to the best of my abilities for me i'm more so focused on eye makeup versus face like right now i don't have on foundation i do have a little bit of concealer on and i do have on lashes and i did my eyebrows but yeah i'm, I'm not too big on how to do makeup but since people have requested it i probably at some point will do a, a get ready with me makeup video. Right now my setup doesn't really lend to me doing it effectively so it probably won't start anytime soon but just want to throw that little tidbit out there. So yeah that's all I have for today with Bobby Boss Yara. Thank you so much for watching and I'll see y'all in the next video. Bye!